with the Irish players taking the knee before kickoff. The Armenians not doing so, neither did the referee. So there we are, underway in this Nations League as Ireland try and win a match in the competition for the very first time. Collins again. Oh, had it, lost it. Had it and lost it again. And there's oh. Kelleher with the save. It's a really Bar decent shot. Mark with the shot. Uh, he, out of nowhere, just drops. Collins tries to do a little pirouette in the middle, loses it. And he out of nothing, he spins, gets a shot away. It's going near post. Kelleher is live to it, gets down. It's a good hand. Haroyam with the long clearance. Josh Cullen started well, but Armenia have had more of the ball. Here's Robinson, first time, side netting. Side netting. It's much better. When Cullen gets it, he looks up. Ogbeni's pulling himself in a really good position. He's dropped in between the lines. And as he turns, Robinson is off making that run. He finds a pass and first time gets it. Just can he hit the target, but it's better from Ireland. Much, much better. A good bit of space Ogbeni's found himself in, though. He's just drifted off. And they haven't been able to come with him. They're afraid of his pace in behind, yep. so they don't want to come in. I think with the heat at the moment, you're going to struggle to keep that pitch wet at all. You could be yeah. on all day, all night, and it'd still be dry. Jeff Hendrick. Ogbeni's got in around the back. Ogbeni with the cross. And Robinson, it's gone wide. Gone out for a corner. Got a touch. Yeah, again, a really good run by Ogbeni. He's been the one that's causing problems. Smart, clean, in behind, onside. Jeff picks out the pass, and he gets his head up. He just tries to pull it back to Robinson. He just doesn't get the contact he wants on it. It's just dinked up to him. It looks like it may have been drifting to that far post, but I don't think he's got the contact he wanted. Yeah, it was uh, an unusual looking clearance from Hambart Sumian. Passing and there's Cullen and Shane Duffy, and that is never going to trouble Yurchenko in the Armenian goal. He just opened. Up too early almost, isn't he? Can't, can't get it down. There's not loads of pace on the cross either. He no. seems to be kind of struggling to cover the ground. He looked like he was when he was going back to pass the bat. By Ramyan, and that is a foul by Cullen on the Armenian attacker. The chance for him to run at Irish defenders, or was it indeed is Stevens, but. It's a free kick for Armenia, nothing more. Yeah. Got away from Egan. Again, he just well, turns well. Caught by Egan, yeah. Yeah, he gets caught. He, he turns a little touch, but he's been, a, he's been influential in trying to get them on the ball and play. You can see they've got high hopes for him. He's a good is on the set piece again. Go Kelleher on. has had one really good save to make. Bishak Chian with the free kick. Travelled a long way, drilled it in low. No problems for Kelleher, though. Jeff Hendrick. Now three ahead of him. Robinson's got through the middle. Big chance this. It just runs away from Robinson. Goalkeeper out of his line. He couldn't get the shot away. Ogbeni does get the shot away, but he's tugged it wide. It's excellent play from Jeff Hendrick in the middle of the park. His first touch sets him up to get forward. And then Robinson makes the run. And somehow the ball just drifts away from you. feel like he's going to get there. It's an excellent pass into the area. But he turns back. And he sees Ogbené, who just pulls his shot wide. And, you know, it was a great opportunity to get another one on target, but we don't. It's a big chance for Ireland. Haroyan had gone back on the line beside Yurchenko. I really like the position Jeffy got in there and his body position. Collins lets it run through to Coleman. Ogbené. He's going to get a free kick this time. He has, he's been fouled many, many times, and the Romanian officials have given him very little. Nothing, to be honest. Like he's come right through the back of him there. That could be a card, but he's trying to He's make him run. It's hard to defend these when you're running back towards your goal. So this in the first of two added minutes at the end of the first half. Cullen's delivery. On its way, oh! off the top of the net, Ogbeni. Oh, free header, he's got to hit the target there. The ball in is brilliant, he's free, he's on his own. It's all the time in the world, he just gets it wrong. 
gets a decent connection on it, but puts it over the bar. Oh, that's a great chance. It's, that, should go, that should be a goal. That is a great chance, and he's been in such super form for his club, Rotherham, and also for Ireland, with involved in what four. Bargsegian had that shot which Kelleher saved in the first half, and there's some pace about them now. Spertsian for Armenia. Spreads the ball out wide and just looking for the slightest of touches there. It's gone out of play. Shane Duffy was, uh, well, having trouble with Bargsegian. They, they broke really well there. Great overlapping one. It comes out to this side here. The ball's fed into a really dangerous area. Just feeds it in there. Duffy's getting across and slides in to put him off. Just does enough. We're have, there's a potential penalty check actually here. And the check is now over. But Farr did have a look at that challenge from Duffy. Use his full squad for Total this. loss in concentration there from Ender Stevens. Armenia on the attack again. Barsegman and it's played wide. All about the cross now. Barsegian gets it out of his feet. Goal! <laughs> Offside, no. Flag up. The goal will not count. The goal will not count. Assistant referee had the flag up. Barsegian just slumped to his knees after he saw the flag go up here. Now they are checking the goal, whether it can be allowed to stand. They're checking offside leading yeah. up to the goal. He's offside, you can see it from the pictures yeah. here, he's definitely offside, but how much time and space he had. Ireland that led off because he was in acres. He didn't need to be offside. It's a silly decision. Troy Parrott, there was a foot left in there on Parrott as well. He just managed to jump out of the way. Coleman, Cullen, Robinson, Robinson shot, just wide. Yeah, better, good position again between the lines, gets his head up, gets a shot away on his left foot. I think what's happening is Jeff Hendrick, I think, is getting too close to the forward line, which is occupying too much space. I think he needs to come slightly deeper because we have three up there already, and all you're doing is come. Yurchenko with the big clearance. Barsegian is the player underneath it. Bishak Tian, Ireland have pushed up the field. He's all on his own, trying to weave his way past Duffy and Collins. Did well to hang on to the ball, did really well. Barsegian had the ball in the back of the net, ruled out for offside. Spertian, that's an awful clearance by Duffy, given straight to Bayraman. Hambart Sumyan. Barsegian, curl it again. Oh! That's some left foot he has. I thought that was going to nest in the top corner. He just opens himself up and it was almost a carbon copy from the finish he put in the back of the net. Whips it in over the bar, but they're, they're really growing in confidence. You see in around the box, Ireland are scuffing clearances. We're not getting rid of the ball properly and we're letting them get into the game. But they're dictating it to us now. We need to get back in control and start dictating the tempo of the match. Here's Coleman's corner. More height on it this time. Collins attacking. And Duffy's header straight at Yurchenko. It wasn't far enough either side of him, and they looked to break really quickly, Armenia. Seamus Coleman, who took the corner, covered a lot of ground to get back there and get in front of Adam Jan, the Armenian substitute. There's a decent ball in, and Duffy gets a good contact on it. I think that's the first attempt on target by us. You can't generate that much pace, and it's straight to the goalkeeper, but at least it's a decent area and using our size. By Ramyan for Armenia. That's Cullen there with him. He's had a big game in the middle of the field. Obafemi hit the deck. This is Grigorian. Furthest forward he's been all second half. Spertian. He had a fair bit of pace as well. By Ramyan. Hambart Sumyan. Barsegian was in there. Egan hit the deck inside the penalty area. They're able to deal with it, Ireland, and Cullen plays the ball up towards Obafemi with Haroyan giving away, though. Spertian for Armenia. Their crowd getting more involved now. Spertian with the shot. Goal! <laughs> Armenia take the lead in the 74th minute. We're not quite sure what aspect of this there could be a problem over, but have a look. He carried the ball a long, long way, and that is some finish off the post. 
Uh, it's, it's a wonderful strike, but no one gets out to him, no one gets near him. Everybody's backing off, and he gets his head up. He catches it so well. Keller has no chance. Like, he's pulled off a really good save in the first half, but this one, he's not getting near any, anyway. Wow, that Ireland have to step up now. They have to get into this game. The goal is good, and it was such a good goal. We'll be very keen to keep this unbeaten run going. Just over five minutes left. Ogbené, that's a foul. At last, he, get, he gets a decision, but the, there could be no other decision there. It was as clear as day. No, but it's brilliant from Ogbené again. Like, he's no real right to get that, but he doesn't give it up. He harasses the defender, gets the ball back, and puts us in a position where we can get a decent ball in. And we've looked most threatening from set play, so make sure this counts. Mirchan has been booked for that. So Jeff Hendrick has gone across. So there's a lot of jostling in there. The referee just making sure it's all in order before the ball is kicked. It'll be a free-for-all after that. Hendrick hoists it up there. Just wide. Just wide. Yeah. Egan and Duffy were both there. If anything, it was kind of hanging too long in the air, yeah. wasn't it? The thing is, it's, it's the right ball to put in because they haven't been able to deal with it because of our height and our strength in the air. When it's, when it's trying to whip it in, we've been hitting the first man. When we just kind of flow into an area, it allows those two big lads to come on meet it. And it's looked like the best chance of us getting a goal this second half, but just can't uh -huh. hit the target. Yeah, and so do I mean, you know, they, they were, you can tell they weren't going to commit many bodies forward in that attack. They were just going to sit back and let those two go. McLean. Brown. Hendrick has space in front. Ogbené available again. Collins has moved back out the field. Ogbené's cross. Oh. Oh. It's a really good delivery. Oh. He just stands into that far post. It's just a little bit ahead of the play. No one can get on the end of it, but he's being the brightest spark. He's the only one that looks like he's going to create anything. And just keep now, beating the appeals ball. Appeals for handball. We play on. This is it. McLean on his right boot. And the cross has gone away from the clump of Irish players. There is the full-time whistle. Armenia celebrate as if they've won Group B, but they've started with a huge victory here. Their first over the Republic of Ireland.